Hey guys, we're here with another Oreo taste test. It's a brand new one, just came out today, October 9th. Actually, Marco found them. We were at Walmart and he spotted them out. I'd heard about them, but I didn't know they were, when they were coming out. But I guess they just came out today, I found out. They are the new Mystery Oreos. What is it, what is it? <laughs> so, by the looks, it is just, just the regular chocolate uh, wafer Oreo, and then looks like a white cream, but it says on here, guess the flavor for a chance to win $50,000. We could win $50,000. You can, uh, there's like two different ways. You can um, text your answer to this number, or you can go on uh, oreomystery.com and submit your answer. So I'm assuming it's just gonna be some kind of new flavor and then you have to guess what it is and if you get it right, you win $50,000. I'm assuming it probably wouldn't be a flavor they already had out. It's probably some kind of new flavor maybe, I'm not sure. So we'll see what we think. Uh, it's another lift tab package and it's um, this one's a little bit bigger. It says serving size two cookies and servings per container 15. Usually it's only 10 and there's usually 20 cookies. So this is 15. So that means there's 30 cookies in here. So we got Yay. 10 more cookies than the regular ones that are uh, for the most of the newer flavors that have been coming out. So we'll open it up and see what it smells like. There's 30 cookies. Yeah. Smells like. Smells. It smells fruity. Smells kind of cereal. Very fruity. It smells like fruity pebbles or something. Do you think so? Yeah, that's definitely fruity pebbles or something like that. Fruit yeah. loops, maybe. Fruit loops, fruity pebbles, something, something fruity, very fruity. Yeah, fruity, fruity pebbles. Fruity, yeah, fruity pebbles. Okay. Let's see. There's a lot of things out of fruity though. Let's open this up. It's just the same. It's just a white. It looks like a regular Oreo, pretty much. Just the regular white with the chocolate wafer. That's one. So we get another one. Let's just try what? one here. Oh look, there's one without a. Oh no, no that one just fell apart. I thought there was a way for that just by itself, but it fell off the other one. The fat part fell off. Okay, so let's try out this Mr. Oreo and see what we think. Out of the package, I think it definitely smells like a, like a Fruit Loops or something. It does. It smells very fruity. Does it tell like a fruity fruit? cereal. Okay. You can do the milk first. I'm going to take a bite without the milk first. It tastes like three pebbles to me, but a little different. Guess what I'm thinking. There's a little bit of difference. Something in there that's not like a fruity pebble. It has an initial taste of like a fruity pebble fruitness, but there's something, a different other flavor that's sitting in there that's not exactly like fruity pebbles. But I'm not sure what it is. To me, it tastes like fruit loops, but I think it, it has tastes a like chocolate tricks. flavor. I, maybe it's the chocolate that's going with that. It's not. Coca pebbles. Whatever it is, it's not. <laughs> I'm not crazy about it though. It tastes like Fruit Loops within that, uh, maybe it's that chocolate mixing in you know, with that Fruit Loops that's just kind of weird to me. It's like that, it's like the chocolate wafer is mixing, this chocolate wafer flavor is mixing with that Fruit Loop flavor and it's just well, kind I'm of trying it with different it by to itself. Me. Taste it without the wafer. I can only have one. Let me try that. I'm gonna try it. Mm -mm. I can't get it off. Mine was pretty easy. See, it tastes fruit loopy to me, but the chocolate is what I think throws it for a loop when you eat it with the mm -mm. chocolate. You gotta try the whole thing. Mm. It's like.
It doesn't. I taste fruity pebbles. With just the cream, I get fruity pebbles. It's Fruit Loop. Apple Jacks. That's the last thing I, I don't think Fruit Loops, I think Fruity Pebbles. Apple Jacks, that doesn't even taste, not even close no, to Apple Jacks. I don't get no apple at all. Totally that tastes fruity. like the cinnamon and everything. Cinnamon? There's no cinnamon. I get no cinnamon. I get, that's where I'm tasting cinnamon. I don't taste any cinnamon at all. It's definitely fruity, mm -hmm. but like not. Captain Crunch probably? I just, I get Fruity Pebbles. I don't get Fruit Loops. I mean, maybe kind of Fruit Loops, but I get more Fruity I'm just, Fruity Pebbles is my mind. Good, we have to guess right so we can get that money. Yeah, I, it's definitely the chocolate wafer that, with just the cream, I don't get that little bit of funny flavor. It's that chocolate wafer mixed. It's that, the wa chocolate wafer mixed with the Fruity Pebbles is kind of funky to me a little bit. Maybe if they would have made like, I think maybe it might have been better with the vanilla wafer. With the with the golden Oreo instead of the chocolate. Yeah, because I think the chocolate kind of throws it off. But maybe the chocolate was supposed to go with it. And maybe something that goes with the chocolate. So what does it, what is fruity with chocolate in it? Oh, take this. I don't know. This tastes like them too. I don't know, it kind of has your like, yeah, it, mm. I don't. I don't like that chocolate. It's not my favorite fruit. Oreo either. I don't really care for it to be honest. It's okay, but that chocolate does not go well with that fruity flavor to me. Mm. Let me see. I have to uh, try it with milk since I haven't tried it with milk. I got my milk out here. I tried the cream by itself, and then I got to try it with the milk. See, so maybe that makes a little bit of a difference, but I'm still gonna stick with fruity pebbles. I think is what I'm thinking, but. <gasps> Cocoa Pebbles. Cocoa Pebbles. Cocoa Pebbles. Why are you saying that? Are you reading the ingredients? Yes. What does it say? It's not. It says there's no cocoa in. There's no cocoa. The only cocoa would be the wafer. And chocolate. So chocolate, that's the wafer. Probably cocoa in the wafer for chocolate, because there's chocolate wafer. Mm. It doesn't no. say wafer. Uh, if anything, what's alk al al or alkali? I don't know. Probably some. Something some, that's gonna give us cancer. Probably, probably some bad chemical that we're not supposed to be eating. <laughs> anyway, if anything in the milk, the only difference I notice is that it's not as. It tastes better in the milk. It it dilutes that chocolate flavor a little bit and makes it mix full. When you dip it in milk, it blends that flavor together a little bit better than it does. It's a lot stronger when I eat it without the milk. It's not as bad with the milk. It's a little bit better with the milk, but I still get fruity, fruity pebbles to me. So, all right, I'm going to stick with fruity pebbles. Let's see your guess. Fruit Loops? Mm -hmm. Brad guesses Fruit Loops. I'm guessing the Mr. Flavor is fruity pebbles. What do you guess the Mr. Flavor is? But they've already had a fruity pebbles, haven't they? They had a. That's what I'm, I'm thinking. Cocoa yeah, pebbles. They did have something like that. Cocoa. I don't think it was called fruity pebbles. But it was called like, uh, oh gosh, it had that cereal in the front of it, but it wasn't called fruity pebbles cereal. Uh, I just call. It I just say like fruity pebbles. Fruity crisps Oreo or something like that. I'd have to go back on our videos and look, because I think we had it. I'm pretty sure we did try to taste test that. Maybe it's not. That's what I'm getting. So I, I don't know I don't get anything else from. I want that mula. So what did you guess? Fruity pebbles. Fruity pebbles. All right. What did you guess, Marco? Cocoa pebbles. Cocoa pebbles. Okay, Mark. Marco doesn't say cocoa pebbles. <laughs> yeah, that might be an idea actually because they do have cocoa pebbles, but I can't. Maybe it's cocoa pebbles and fruity pebbles together. But I don't. Good. I don't think cocoa the... pebbles taste fruity though. Do they? They just no, taste no, like they chocolate. Don't. It's just chocolate. It's just chocolate and there's no fruitiness. I definitely get fruitiness in this. It's fruity. Maybe it's like fruity pebbles with, maybe it's fruity pebbles and chocolate. Cocoa, Cocoa pebbles. pebbles together. Maybe. Cocoa I don't pebbles. Know. <laughs> that's a funny name. Cocoa. Well, anyway, so that's our guesses. So I guess we'll each have to vote separately then. And whoever wins the $50,000 has to share. Not. Okay, all right, so. My 50,000 is going towards my island I'm gonna buy. Oh, uh, no, that 50, that 50 well, grand is going to a new car. That island. That's going a new car for who? For us. For me. They call me the best driver. Oh, yeah, right. The best driver. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys look back into the videos, <laughs> like when we went to um, 
We went to learn Branson. First. We went to Branson last year for our vacation in Springfield, Missouri, and Branson. And I wasn't paying attention and like we'd go karting. <laughs> and like I didn't pay attention where there was like this big thing and I went, don't. Yeah, he ran to the back of the other drivers. What? I was giving him a hard time about that. That's how you're supposed to And then to when do. I. I let him pull my car in the garage a few months back. He gunned it too. You mean out of the drive? Well, yeah, it was out of the drive because yeah. I do fine with Brad's truck. It's just your car. My, I had my new Escape and it was it's very sensitive on the gas too. So you don't have to push on it real a lot to get it to go. So all right. So anyway, that's our review of the Mystery Oreo. Taste test, please let us, or the new Mr. Oreos, comment below if you've tried them and let us know what you think it is and see if you agree or maybe if you think of something else. Thumbs down or thumbs what up. What it is. So we'll enter and see if we maybe win. So, all right. Thanks for watching and we'll see you all in our thumbs next video. Up and subscribe for more videos. All right. Bye. Bye. Bye, y'all.